Hey everybody, this is Jasmine Nguyen from successwithjasmine.com How are you doing? Hey, Alekan, Ahmed So right now I'm doing a, a bonus scope to share a friend, uh, Rick, one of my entrepreneur friends Hey Ron Dering Awesome. One of my entrepreneur friends uh, actually messaged me on Facebook uh, inviting me to um, to speak at his entrepreneurial events next year on 6 January 2016. So he asked me to uh, share my entrepreneur journey and story with them and um, he wants me to also create a video so I thought that I'll do a periscope and at the same time create a video as well. Hey Diva Deb, I'm really Really proud of you create uh, getting your very first lead hey one two three three NS I'm not very sure whether is there a technical um, technical issue just now on periscope hey AB tweet as UK so um, but just now um, I shared um, at my 9 p.m. scope I shared how my clients um, Barbara which is diva Deb on the scope got her very first lead so what is the mindset that she has hey ab and she's really 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 awesome and how um and how you can also uh get your very first lead if uh yeah so do check the scope up and if you double tap on the screen you can see that there's different colors of hearts and snowflakes coming out this is a christmas uh, special edition so um, do double tap on the screen and send more um, hearts and snowflakes coming out. So it will be Christmas really soon in Singapore right now. It's 9.35 p.m. right here in Singapore. So in a few hours time, it will be Christmas. So I'm also pretty excited. Thanks Laura, for inviting 8 people. Yes, do invite this um do invite your friends to come on this scope by double tapping on the screen uh no <laughs> double tapping on the screen is to send some hearts and no freaks over inviting the scope is swipe right or left or up or down depending on whether you're using android or iphone thanks from the ring for inviting followers or you can click on the little guy at the bottom right hand corner and click the share button thanks from the ring for sending 235 hearts and barbara for sending 45 hearts and drew for 29 hearts and thanks AB Tweet S U K for sharing on Twitter and inviting your followers to this scope. So we'll be getting started really, really, really soon. Uh, if you'd like to connect with me, this is my Facebook at facebook.com slash successwjasmine. Click on the like button and uh, click on the message button to get in touch with me and find out how you can be also one of the three to qualify for my um free one-on-one -on -one Skype coaching call to get your very first lead and sales and your business and if you like this is my blog sswithjasmine.com so hey 3238 this is a bonus scope where I'll be sharing um, my entrepreneurial journey um, okay so for those who came in who just came in I'm Jasmine from Singapore I do a daily scope at 8 a.m. Eastern Time, 9 p.m. Singapore Time, every single day sharing business mindset, personal development, internet marketing, and network marketing tips. So uh, this is actually a bonus scope and it's an unannounced bonus scope. So only my followers will be able to be notified when I have bonus scopes. And sometimes I do have bonus scopes. Yeah, and double turn the screen to send some snowflakes over and, and to see the snowflakes popping. Pop, pop, pop. Yeah, so um, so uh, what I want to say is uh, when I when I first started, uh, how I got started in my entrepreneurial journey. This is a question which uh, intrigues many people. Yes, hello, Nafar, A S Y A B. How are you doing? So everybody, type in the comment box below your name and the country which you're from and also if you have any questions while I'm um, sharing my story uh, do tap in the comment box below and double turn the screen to send the snowflakes and hearts coming because Christmas is coming so uh, for me I started in my entrepreneurial journey in 2013 AB tweet as you came Andrew Wales awesome 
in 2013. So what happens is, um, thanks for the compliments. What happens was at a point in, uh, okay, maybe I should rewind back a bit. Yeah, so I actually went to uh, the university called Singapore Management University in Singapore and I studied uh, information system management, which is business IT and corporate communications. So while I was doing my degree there, I actually went for some techno study mission. So it's a uh, technology, study mission which is overseas trip to vietnam to visit startup companies in vietnam and learn from the entrepreneurs there and i realized that um it is really 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 awesome to be an entrepreneur and really inspires me to be an entrepreneur one day and this sparks my interest in entrepreneurship so i took another two more courses actually another four more courses in entrepreneurship and and when I graduate from university, um, I got the three job offers, two being a pro programmers and one being a marketing executive. So um, I actually wanted to go for a graduation trip, so I turned down all three offers. And and I remember um, one of the school uh, office staff, the school admin staff, hey, W. Patterson, I'm glad you can join us today. I'm sharing about my entrepreneur journey. So the school ME assistant actually told me that um, this is your very last chance to really, really go on a very long trip. Because after you start work, you have to work for 40 years of your life and you'll be great, uh, you will be retiring at about 65 years old. And every single year in Singapore, your, uh, the amount of leave, leave means uh, the amount of like days that they give you off from work is about 14 to 21 days yeah usually it's 14 to 21 days so and you need to spend it wisely so you can't really go on long trips and you'll be working for the rest of your life for the next 40 days 40 years so um so i took her advice and i really went for a graduation trip to uh, many countries i visited australia hong kong europe and um in Europe, I went for this call. Uh, it's something like a graduation. Um, it's something like exchange. So it's a free mover, a uh, program. And while there, I was exposed to the culture. Wow, twenty eight days. That's really awesome. I was exposed to the culture in the Europe and. It's very different from Singapore, so it really opens my mind. And when I come back to Singapore in January uh, 2013, I was uh, actually looking not just for a fresh grad job, but I was looking for something which I'm very passionate about. So at the time, I actually wanted to jump into entrepreneurship, but I realized that I have no business experience, no marketing, no sales, I'm not streetwise, I don't have contacts. And so I decided that perhaps I'll work for five years first. To gain all this experience, all this contacts before I jump into entrepreneurship. So that was my plan actually, my previous plan. And so I I didn't know what I really wanted to do, so I took some uh, I took an internship at an advertising agency to know uh, whether do I really want to go into advertising and uh, corporate comms. So uh, it was pretty fun uh, internship, but I realized that is mm, there's something missing. So I still wanted to to explore some more. So after that, I took up uh, a job stint for a few months in a startup company, social enterprise startup company in Singapore, and this is really really fun. Um, I get to do. It's really, really small company where uh, there's only the manager and me and the retail staff and the workshop staff and I get to manage every single thing. So I get to do every single part of the business ranging from creating the marketing materials. Hey, Sima, thank too cool to join us. Creating the marketing materials to managing um, the, the vendors for our website because they are developing a website at the point in time and uh, the manager is uh, isn't able to manage like like he doesn't know tech stuff so so he asked me to go and communicate with the 
a vendor and to design the website for him I also write the website um, copy and I, I was also the photographer for the to take up the photos of the products in the gift store I created their marketing materials sometimes when the retail staff is sick I also jump in and become the retail staff <laughs> hey teaching go giants or oh, this is too busy I jump in to become a retail staff I also went to the workshop and uh, and supervise the elderly residents uh, in in that in making the handicrafts and I also uh, do the accounts yeah the accounting stuff and the CPS stuff so I did everything in the startup and I really realized that um, it's a good learning experience yeah it's busy uh, and it's a very good at learning experience um, then my manager told me that asked me to go and look for a real corporate job because there isn't much career advancement in the uh, startup company. It's only me and my manager. So if I were to um, be like promoted, is when my manager left. So there's not much career progression, and he really encouraged me to gain more experience uh, through a corporate job. So that's what I did, and I applied for a job, and I got it, and and I worked for uh, this. Yeah, hey Eater Guru forty one. What do you do? Yeah, I'm now I'm now currently an entrepreneur. I'm an internet marketer. I'm also uh creating uh writing my own book on how to overcome your fear of public speaking in seven days, which are released in end January in two thousand and sixteen. I'm also a content writer for one of the um seminar and businesses in Singapore and I'm currently doing giving bonus coaching programs for my elite marketing pro members just for the Christmas yeah it's a Christmas gift so I usually I charge 300 USD for my coaching for one hour so I'm giving it for free and I'm going to help them to get their very first lead and very first sale and I'm creating videos for them as well so that's I'm pretty busy at the moment and uh, one of my friends actually invited me to share about my entrepreneurial journey next year, um, 6 January 2015, to his entrepreneurial uh, group. So now I'm creating, uh, I'm sharing the experience with everyone here. Hey, Kista, how is everybody doing? Hey, LT Millionaire from Atlanta. Yeah, if you are new to the scope, uh, type in the comment box below the name and the country which you're from and double tap on the screen to see snowflakes and hearts popping up and click on the little guy at the bottom right hand corner and click the follow button because I do a daily scope at 8am Eastern time every single day sharing business, mindset and personal development tips. So just now we were talking about um, my experience so after I gotten um, I went for the interview and at the interview I actually I actually wanted a social media marketing job so um, that was that was my meaning and the director of the company actually told me that I'll be working on their social media channels when I get hired so I say yes and and after that immediately I went to work but on the first day I realized that um, it's not what it seems because because the job that um, they gave it to me is not um, not the social media marketing job that they have promised me so they actually put me in the uh, fundraising department so it's a volunteer and fundraising department in the hospital and they put me in this fundraising department and for fundraising what you got to do is mostly uh, accounting related stuff like you got to create excel spreadsheet you got to plan um plan the amount of donations that come in what you do with the donations and stuff like that so it's really really more related to accounts which i have no knowledge or experience about because i'm not an accountant <laughs> yeah hey bris 14 awesome to great join us today and um, there's there's two sub departments. So one is the um, volunteer management. The other one is the fundraising. So junior marketing's exploited job role. 
uh, it depends. Usually they have this uh, specific role in, in Singapore, social media marketing, and it's related more to marketing in general. But uh, definitely, if you're, it's not related to accounts. Because for fundraising, you need account more accounting background related people to do it. Yeah, so so that was what uh, happens. A, B, that's great interaction so far. Yeah, everybody, I encourage you to uh, type in the comment box below if you have a comment or you if you have questions for me and I'll answer the question. So what happens was that happens and um, at the same time because the, the department was having a lot of office politics, so many people actually left the department like within three months, one to three months. So um, a lot of employees left and they have a lack of manpower and they are also holding like few events um, over there and and so I have really have to take on the roles of like two to three people in that whole department the, at two sub departments and I managed to finish the job every day at 6.30 p.m. before I went home hey Bo Tian one do one however um, I realized that at 6.30 p.m. every single day my manager will come to my desk and she will she will give me even more job so everybody in the department has already left and uh, she'll give me more job and she'll tell me that I have to finish it by 8.30 a.m. the next day when I report to work so what happens is I got to work overtime and sometimes I, I almost every day I have to bring work back home and every day I work hey home runner work till like 1 to 2 a.m. in the morning and I go to work at about 8 30 a.m. so it's really stressful time and at that point in time actually my grand uh, paternal grandmother was suffering from stage 4 cancer so I wasn't able to spend as much time during her last days with her and it really leaves me with deep regret yeah very demanding yes so um, it, this was what happens it leaves me with deep regret and uh, on a few days before she passed on um, because my family mem she was like, in a critical condition at the point in time so uh, my family members actually called me to go uh, like to her bedside because like you don't know when she's going to pass on in a, in a sense so um, I actually told my manager that I got to go uh, but I will finish the work because they have this event on Saturday so on Friday night I got caught um, actually I was already working overtime like 10 p.m. in the office so my mom actually called me to tell me that I have, I have to go because uh, my grandma may pass on any moment so I told my manager that and she she said that perhaps you don't care about your work yeah that's how and you care about your grandma more than your work that's what she tell me so I told her that um, I will actually finish the work and I'll bring it over for you tomorrow uh, before before um, the event actually started and if I really don't care about my work I won't be staying here until 10 p.m. right here right now doing this work uh, when my grandmother is in critical condition so I really did care about my work and my manager wasn't being fair to me so um, after my grandma actually passed on uh, I realized that there's more to life besides work and this isn't the job that I'm looking for for the next 40 years in my life and neither is any uh, any corporate job in a sense hey <laughs> family first sorry about grand yeah thank you so um, and I also realized was last time I work a lot like when in my study time I really take more modules than necessary and I graduate one year earlier than my batch and I work more than 12 hours a day just studying going for CTAs so I really do more but I didn't really spend as much time uh, with my loved ones like family and friends and I realized that it's really important to spend time with them when they are alive create memories then uh, then when they are gone and regretting so that was that was I woke up from there and I make the decision that uh, I'm gonna really pursue my dream yes life is short and I don't want to live my life with regrets like when I'm 80 and looking back of my life and I see that I regretted not pursuing entrepreneurship 
hey james to own share so i was on uh, that time it was pretty uh good pay for me as a fresh grad so uh i decided that i'm gonna hand in a resignation letter on that monday so that's what i did on monday i hand in a resignation letter and how i managed to do that, do that is because i gave myself two years yes two years to actually learn um learn the skills hey on real money is a byproduct of being a good entrepreneur yes that's true providing value into a marketplace as what ab mentioned and um when you provide good value that your customers want money will come in by itself so it's really a byproduct you have to give value to so um what happens was i quit my job and <laughs> I thought to myself actually at the time my thinking process is like this if I were to spend the next five years just jumping into entrepreneurship yes I, I may not be street wise I may not have the skills knowledge required but if next five years consistently if I work in work uh, on the entrepreneurship aspect in five years time I will be ahead than where I am yes because if I were to continue with my job for the next five years, all I need, all I learn is just um, how to do my job better. But it has not. Yes, I do gain some contacts and I gain some business experience, some um, some contacts, some become. I'm not sure whether I'll become more streetwise because it's a corporate job. There's no textbook for entrepreneurship. That's true. So uh, I realized that it's much better to spend my time my precious life pursuing my dreams so that's what i did i quit my job immediately and uh sent in my resignation letter and i fired my boss and what happens is because in singapore you have to do like one month of uh even after you tender the resignation you have to do one month so that they can find the new stuff to come in so i did my one month and after i finished my one month i actually uh was really looking into learning business experience because jumping into entrepreneurship without any knowledge or business experience or not being street wise is actually not very wise so how do i gain experience yeah like i don't have any friends who are entrepreneurs at that point in time two years ago so what i did was i went to the bookstore and i bought many business self-development mindset marketing books so i bought a lot like from Kinokuniya, which is near my house, and after that, I read. So every day for the next thirty days, I just spend the time reading. I was reading and reading and reading, and every day I was absorbing information. And by the end of thirty days, I have a brief idea of um, what business and entrepreneurship is about, as compared to thirty days ago, and. I still wasn't that streetwise at the point in time, so I was thinking, what should I do? I read one book which really inspires me. It's called Tim Ferriss A Four Hour Work Week, and it really shows me that I can work anytime, anywhere with just a laptop um, and living the lifestyle. So wow, 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 wow! You can work anytime, anywhere with a laptop living the lifestyle that was like wow my blowing for me so what i did was um i really really wanted to be like tim ferris <laughs> this day many people go to youtube learn new things yeah at the time two years ago i uh i wasn't streetwise so i only read books but nowadays i um did i'll share in my journey that i actually attended many uh seminars both locally internationally and i also um invested in video audio course sam webinars and i also went to youtube to learn so that that was uh, a bit later on <laughs> but at the start i was not streetwise so i didn't know much <laughs> hey no. youtube is good as a lot of rough though yes you had to see through the rough to get the gold gems so um after that uh, I went online to search because I really want I love to travel so I thought I was looking for some business ideas maybe I should travel and and do something related to internet marketing so I was looking for a niche actually 
and I come across this website called Terabinia Lifestyle Terabinia Life Terabinia Life yeah Terabinia Life and I just and the photo is there is pretty cool like there's three guys that really travel our world in airplanes and exploring many awesome places with interesting experiences so um so I messaged them because I really really wanted this lifestyle and they say that you can make money from laptop so I messaged them and and um I got involved in my network marketing company travel network marketing company and it has really helped me a lot in the past uh, two years in terms of hey the laughter rebel great to join us today in the last two years uh, Mike from Marine yes I heard about him before Mike from Marine so it really transformed me in the sense that uh, two years ago I wasn't able to hold a conversation more than five minutes with a person and I don't dare to approach before and um, I was like a newbie so two years later it has transformed me to be able to speak on uh, in front of a live audience to host my own periscope and also uh, really to lead my team and to add value and coach others and share my knowledge and experiences with others as well so it's pretty pretty awesome and at the point in time I'm also um, looking to learn internet marketing so I sign up for local course in Singapore on internet marketing I also learn to various uh, online program which one of them is the elite marketing pro and um, I gain knowledge along the way um, at the time I was more focused on building myself like my mindset and doing personal development because uh, I realized that mindset is really, really, really important in entrepreneurship. You've got to be mentally strong. You've got to be able to face rejections. You've got to, uh, you got to work on yourself to become a better version of yourself and be more authentic in a sense and be more confident. So there's many skills I have to work on and every single month I will work on one specific skill. So one of the first skill that I work on is actually how to start a conversation with people yes hey Zigo Tan awesome so uh, because in my network marketing company I have to like approach people and set up appointments so invite people so um, I in order to face the fear of um, really approaching people in general I went for networking sessions two to three times a week and sometimes four times so every single day evening I will go out to networking sessions like in Singapore so I'll go for people's course reviews I'll go for any meetup groups I'll go for networking sessions and every single session I only have one specific goal which is to introduce myself to the person sitting next to me only one goal. Authenticity is being real. If you can be real, you can be confident. Yes, that's very true, AV. So, I um I was where was I? So, oh uh, yeah, I went to every networking sessions and one goal to just speak to the person next to me for five minutes, introduce myself, and also get the person's name and contact number. So I did that for like two months I think two months one month yeah, one month or two months and eventually I become proficient in it after that so I was able to talk to people for five minutes at a time and get people's name and phone number <laughs> yeah so I <laughs> that's what that's what I did and it really also exposed me to many different uh, business ideas in Singapore because uh, because I I went to many networking sessions and after that I moved on to work on becoming uh, more confident because so I work on my confidence level and I work on my presentation skills I work on myself and I work on being more um, more charismatic I work on improving my communication skills. How long did after you start your online business, you fire a boss? Um, for me, uh, it's a bit different. I fire my boss first before I start my online business. 
because I gave myself five years to make it in the entrepreneur world. And I believe in myself and I believe that I'm able to find the correct mentor and the correct uh, system and the knowledge to get started in entrepreneurship. So it was a bit different from the rest actually. But I, I had some savings like before before that I was working so so um, I didn't really spend overspend. So for me I I worked then I did eat like I go out for just normal lunch but usually I don't spend on other unnecessary stuff so I had some savings which lasted me for like a few months so so that's awesome and what I realized is that if you really really want something even if you don't know or you have you're not streetwise, you will just go out there and search for the information. And when you are like, you're all in 100%, when you search for the information, even if you feel the first time, it won't deter you. If you feel the second time, it still doesn't deter you. You feel a feel, feel again and you eventually succeed. So that was what I realized in my entrepreneur journey. Hey, careful, glue. And so at the time I was also uh, learning about uh, my, I'm trying to fire my boss quickly. What are you currently doing, Toshe64? Like, are you in uh, business? Are you internet marketing? Or are you in like network marketing? Because for me, um, I'm currently, you probably need at least six months savings plus a startup cost. Yeah, that's a good, uh, that's a good. Um, no, for internet marketing is pretty, uh, it's not that, much actually you can you can if you find the right mentor you'll be able to um, and put in the hard work of course and learn the skills you'll be able to make it fast yeah but it really depends on your the amount of time and effort that you're willing to put in so uh, to share if you are interested because I'm one of the marketing education and lead Ah, network marketing for health and wellness company. How are you generating leads so far? Are you doing it online or offline? I for me, I, I'm generating leads online. So, um, I'm le- I learned marketing uh, education, internet marketing education, and lead generation. Uh, this lead generation system that really helps me to generate leads both for my network marketing business and also for my other businesses as well and I learned really internet marketing skills and if you're interested you can hit me up at Tasha and Ram help you get started facebook.com slash success double jasmine facebook.com slash success double jasmine um, Tasha uh, I want you to take a screenshot of this and and click the like button and send me a message. Reach out to me. Take a screenshot of this. Because um, I'm offering a one-on-one coaching right now as a bonus for my Edit Marketing Pro sign-ups. Education and Edit Generation System. And I'm going to help um, those who sign up like before 31st December 2015, the next three people to uh to really get their first lead and first sale and i'm um, right now I'm making videos as well sharing the knowledge that at SP- i have personally gotten in internet marketing step by step in videos so i'll share it with the my members so if you like to learn uh lead generation slow moving professor process and you get it um it depends at first it was slow but if you have a mentor to help you uh it will be faster because uh, i just finished a coaching call with one of my clients and she she is um she's really awesome because she's an action taker and she's she's barbara on diva Deck on the scope getting ready to work i'll do 13 hour shift that's what i mean now yeah so you got to have uh, you got to really uh, reach out to me and uh, we will check more on the Facebook how you can 
really far about because 13 hours is really long hours like you don't really have much time after you go home from your work so generating leads online is really a leverage and she is really awesome she take action and she's gotten her very 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 first lead and i'm very proud of her because she also wrote a blog post and uh, showed it to me for uh, asking me for advice today so she really take the initiative and she took action so kudos kudos to you barbara awesome so double tap on the screen to send Barbara some hearts and uh, some snowflakes to give her encouragement. She's new. And okay, back to my story. So for me, it took me two years. Um, and last year, actually, it's not really two years because last year, about September. So it's only one year and about one year yeah it t took me one year to work on my mindset i was really focused on working on my mindset and personal development for that first year and the second year i was working on my marketing skills and i was doing freelance website development in singapore so i applied the knowledge that i learned in the internet marketing pro to my offline business which is the freelance website development and i managed to get um earned 18k in one month so i get eighteen thousand dollars worth of website development deals in just one month so that's what you can do basically once you've learned skills and in may this year hey change boss 86 may this year i joined another internet marketing seminar in singapore and uh, it's a seminar where they teach you internet marketing. They teach you how to be a business consultant, author, and and hi, I'm Jasmine from Singapore. Hey, Tokum, take charge, boss eighty six, Tokuma, Washington. Yeah, double tap the screen to send some hearts and share this code with others by shopping right, left, up or down, depending on whether you're using Android, or iPhone. I'm sharing my entrepreneur journey. So, I was, I was. Uh, one of the affiliate they have these affiliate programs and I promote the program which was a pioneer program so so I'm the pioneer batch and I promoted it for 30 days and from there I got $7,000 worth of sales and I stayed on top of the leaderboard in that specific affiliate program for that specific one month the four weeks that I was actively promoting for that one month I stayed on top as a leader on a leaderboard so I was the number one position for the four weeks so after that I realized that it's not some not something for me um, and I stopped promoting and I was doing other things so so um, yeah so you can see that internet marketing skills can be applied both in offline businesses and other affiliate products as well once you have learned it and I'm gonna help three more people so contact with me on Facebook so after that, um, in October, um, Sony, which is one of my online friends, actually reached out to me. So, and really uh, connect with me back with the uh, Indie Marketing Pro because last year I joined Indie Marketing Pro just to learn. I I didn't I didn't promote it at all. I just learned it, <laughs> learned the information. I was more interested to learn rather than to promote it. So I was in the learning mode and I learned a lot of things. It's really useful, it helped me a lot. And this year, I already made the decision that when I joined, I'm going to promote it. So, so this year is a bit different from last year because last year there's no Ignition Coaching Program. So this year they have this Ignition Coaching Program which you can speak to a live coach um, for coaching and they'll answer your questions and help you work out a roadmap on how you can achieve your income. Ah, hey Lashen, no worries, I'm still uh, in the midst of uh, sharing my entrepreneur journey, so no worries about it, and you can watch the replay later to find out the first part of my entrepreneurship journey. So what you do now, I'm currently an internet marketer, I'm also a business uh, internet marketing coach, so I do coaching, um, usually it costs $300 an hour for my time where I 
I really get you to do uh, actionable steps that you on the coaching call itself so it's not head knowledge but I really share my experience and the, the actionable steps that has helped me to get my results on the coaching call so right now I'm just opening up to three more people who sign up from an elite marketing pro and I'll give you a coaching call one-on-one -on -one to help you get your very first lead and your very first sale so I'll help you to get your very first lead guide you to get your very first lead and get your very first sale of course you have to implement the knowledge that I shared with you and I'm also creating videos right now to to share some knowledge um, that is for my coaching I cost three hundred dollars an hour, <laughs> but the program itself is not um, is not three hundred dollars an hour. Like for the normal membership is uh, forty seven dollars a month, and if you are in the VIP membership, which allows you to access to even more um, the whole suite of information products that teach you all the skills in the internet marketing you need to know from traffic generation to how to how to become more magnetically attractive to your target audience how to define your target audience how to do marketing how to call your leads and convert them into sales how to create your own information products yeah and also uh, they have ongoing seminars uh, webinars where they share the latest industry tips, tricks, and trends. So that is basically, basically, um, is it very hard to have people? No, no, no. It's not. It's not a large chain. Nine. It's not a pyramid because this is pure affiliate program. So, whatever you earn, even though I help you to get your first lead and your first sale, but I don't earn from your sale. So you earn your commission totally. I didn't I wouldn't earn from your uh from your commission at all. And usually as an affiliate, uh we are not obliged to guide you like because we are just promoting the product, we are just a marketer. But uh just Christmas, which is special and is arriving in two hours time, I'm actually going to uh really offer this bonus session where I will help those who sign up under me to to get started fast get started right and and also to give you coaching program to help you uh, get your first lead and your first sale that's that's it and you can connect with me at facebook.com slash wjasmine which is right here send me a message on facebook and get in touch with you like button and message button So how do you, how do I fire my own boss? Um, just now I shared in the first part that I make a decision to really jump into entrepreneurship without um, and not regret it for the rest of my life. So this is a decision I make. I also am willing to invest the time and effort and money to um, to into my education and also to really try it out and work on my personal development as, as well as my skills hey david ml24 so i give myself five years actually to make it an entrepreneur with the first two years being learning the skills learning the mindset learning the um the marketing skills that was what was my plan but it was a bit accelerated so i'm very happy about it and right now I'm helping others in their entrepreneur journey as well mm. so that's basically what I'm doing and I'm also writing a book which is how to overcome your fear of public speaking in seven days using periscope because last month I actually embarked on a personal challenge to overcome my fear of public speaking and it really works like in seven days I was able to do it so I've also inspired many people around the world to start their very first scope and and I decided to share my experience in a book to really um, new baby this year need to do more for him yes last year nine you need to change badly where do you go to learn the skills um, please reach out to me on facebook.com slash success w jasmine both learning and I will help you to uh, get in 
send you the information yeah so do like my facebook page and send me a message over here like my facebook page and send me a message yes so you can be a mommy blogger you can work from home actually uh last year. send me a facebook message and uh, uh I'll get on a one-on-one -on -one conversation with you and uh, send you a link as well as to see, uh, work out with you how you're, go you're gonna achieve your goals, like how much you need to be financially free to quit your job and also to uh, what you need to do to really achieve your goals in the 30 to 90 days. All right, and make a change and in 2016, you'll be really, really, really awesome. So do, do reach out to me. Have you have you uh, like taken the screenshot? Have you taken the screenshot? If you want to reach out to me, uh, do take a screenshot. Click the like and the message button. Yes, you can do blogging. Blogging is very good. Uh, it's one of the strategies. You need to have a workable funnel and a system as well. So. So reach out to me and I'll send you more information on how to get started with it. And so back to the topic about uh, entrepreneur. Mm. Let's see, where was I? Yeah, so after, hello. So after that, uh, yes. Lashin is a good start to learn about I am and appearance. Uh no, this is not a sex show. This is this is our a scope which I share about my entrepreneur journey. So yep, it's not a sex show. Sorry to this point. <laughs> so um yeah, Lashin, do connect with me and I will send you the relevant information how how you get started uh, to learn I am and internet marketing. And what else? Let me think. Oh yeah, in your entrepreneurial journey, there is many roadblocks. There's obstacles. There's people who will tell you you cannot do it, or there's people who doubt you. There's also um. There's also like sometimes you uh you feel down but you got to really work on your vision like what do you really want so once you have a clear vision clear direction in life you'll be able to work towards it haters gone ahead yeah haters gone ahead we can't be affected by them that's true a eh? between hey Danny mode great to join us today so at first i i was affected by haters last time until until um about october then i seriously get over it hey jarrett cool to join us yeah double turn is free to send some hearts and you can see christmas snowflakes popping up because it is 10 21 pm in singapore so uh you discover your fake friend too Yes, you'll discover your fake friend too. It's gonna be Christmas in two hours, one and a half hours time. And you realize that a lot of people who you thought are your friends may not really support you in your uh, in your entrepreneurial journey. It's either maybe they don't really understand your entrepreneurial journey or maybe they don't they are insecure, like they don't really uh they screenshot you in for already made can i make more than this doing this yeah you can have an additional stream of income and you will make even more as well because you it, it will help you to take your business to the next level as well um let me let me show you for those who are interested uh, this is my facebook at facebook.com slash jasmine and you will work with both a skype coach and all the skills required learn a, uh, you'll work with a Skype coach as well and they will have to yes do find me on Facebook Shane um, have you taken a screenshot to find me so you work with Skype coach to work out your goals for next year and 
they will help (uh) we will help you to take your business to the next level and to increase your income (uh) level as well [oh] dear [oh] dear (mm) let me alright so that's facebook dot com slash success with jasmine ya do click the like button and click the message button to reach out to me searching for another three more people to share my knowledge (um) it has worked very well for me the marketing strategies that I've used it has helped me to grow my instagram (uh) test account yes I created a test account to really test the strategies from (uh) zero to thr~ more than three thousand (uh) instagram followers previously when when I was really very active every single day I was doing it so for periscope it was also the same because I started off with only like three or four (um) three or four followers and actually on the my twenty sixth day of scoping I have over one thousand followers so I was so it has helped me as well my facebook has over one thousand seven hundred friends my personal personal profile page like not my friend fan page (um) and also my linkedin has more than six hundred friends ya !hey! dan forrestal glad to join us ya so do look reach out to me and I'll send you the link and you can check it out for yourself how are you doing so basically that's it and a few months ago I was actually very confused about my direction in life because (uh) I was working on quite a few different projects and I realised that if you really want to succeed in something you have to be clear of about what you want so once I've worked that out (um) it has helped me a lot in the sense that I'm able to know what I'm gonna do and (um) [ah] #Lasheen# has reached out to me that was fast man !wow! awesome 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 so so basically this is summary about (uh) of my entrepreneur journey and I'll share more next time so I hope you guys enjoy it and follow me on periscope so you get more bonus unannounced scopes like this and I usually do a scope at eight A_M eastern time nine P_M singapore time every single day to share business mindset and personal development tips and yup so today actually at in the morning when I woke up I realised that I've earned (uh) five hundred U_S_D in commissions five hundred and ten U_S_D ya I I made another sale today when sleeping and yesterday night at one thirty A_M the sale came in and I was already sleeping at that point in time so so I'm pretty pretty excited and I'm looking to help others achieve this as well so yup you reach out to me and I will I'll get in contact with you and I'll see you next time